everybody, it's Nadia Rowe here again and I'm just bringing to you what I brought from the body shop. So, basically, I don't know if you've heard about him, the new darks and lights. So, basically, what they are, they come like this. I'll just get one for you. This is the dark one. And, obviously, this is for your light. I'm putting the... So you get the name. Uh, so basically, say you've got a foundation that is that, not that little bit old, but basically, out. sorry, I've got a bad pattern, which is basically either a little bit light, a little bit dark, but, you know, it's that summer thing, isn't it? Basically, because we're getting into the summer, I think this is why they brought this out, the way they brought it out. Um, is I know I've got foundations that won't suit me for summer times, which I'll still want to, to use in summertime, but because they're slightly too dark because I've caught the sun, all you do is basically you add a dropper of this and it will make it darker. Or if you've got one that's too dark and you're getting to the point where it's like I've got six foundations now and I can't wear any because they're not my shade if instead of buying another one for 15 to 20 30 pound you buy this lightning that's why it's called lightning this is actually called darkening so you can't go on lightning and darkening and um, basically they're 10 pound each and I was like, so I've got X amount of foundations for me to go out and replace all of them when I get a suntan. It's going to cost me way more than £10. So basically all you do is you put it on, you can get like a palette or you can do it on the back of your hand. You would put your normal foundation and then just put a drop at a time and just test yourself just here along this line until you think it suits you. Um, so I had to wait for this one to come in which was really really nice of the lady they don't have to do it but she was really nice and um, I think with all of them have I got my body shop thing here? No, I think she did me a deal of something like thirty thirty pound, something like that for all three, for all four of these, and it worked out to nearly fifty pound, because that was, I think that was an eighteen pound, because I did want one. I, I've not with the body shop. I don't. Everybody that I know of knows the body shop to be about your body. And I didn't re realise till recently, I nipped in when I was waiting for my friend to turn up, that they did makeup. So at the time I did get colour corrected and all the rest of it. And I lost a sheet and when I went back she did it, we did it all again. So basically I got the instant blur eye. So obviously it's just to get rid of all my bags because I've only got a light, light bit of makeup on today just to come and say hello to you guys and I got a I got obviously the dark one which she then put the light one uh when they when they were got that in I had to pay separately for this this was ten pound and I think this fresh nude foundation now I might be totally wrong but I know it was either I don't think it was the thirteen pound range I think it was more on the 15 to 18 pound range and then I also got which I'm in vanilla O2 and look you see I ended up pumped it just don't want to get loads out as well but that's you can see it's quite runny so if, if I wanted to lighten it I'd just or darken it just put a little bit in and because this is a perfect shade for my face 
you should never go off the back of your hand it's a lot yellow there but I will do a tutorial with this on and you can actually see how nice this is because she did my entire face for me and that's another thing they'll do because I know the first time that I went in I was shocked because she, she was like can I take all your makeup off and I'm like what I've just got ready she went no just just round your face and we all put it all back on you not notice any difference it was like yeah well because I've got that much can't think what it's called what's it called highlighter on I haven't today so but so I'm going to give that a go this these these new new foundations of what I'm going to do is do like a collab to not a collab to sit see how long the best wearing is and all the rest of it but I only wear makeup a couple of three times a week so which is basically when I do your videos um so I'd have to do it take me longer over the days which I'm still going to do might take me three months instead of everybody else's month because they put makeup every day, every day but I don't and then also I got the under eye concealer because it went with foundation and I always think I might not like it I'm not saying I'm going to like it but I always find that if I get the same colour I end up with pretty nice effect so and also people that are on to oh to priority um they've often got deals on for the body shop but also the body shop itself has their own deals on because i think when i went to get this it was if i'd bought the cheap foundation the concealer and something else it came to about 25 pound but obviously I ended up getting the two extra things so this is why I'm saying I can't remember I think I paid about £32 for all of them so and I'm the more expensive foundation because I know, I know it babe because that's what was messing us up but if you know of any deals you go in and see I've just looked at my seat where my friends picked this lightning up £10 off your next purchase when you spend £15. My dear daughter's birthday coming up soon. I'll get one of them. I'll get her a foundation. I'll get her a thingy. £10 off. 25 quid. She's happy. She's got her presents. I'm happy because I've saved myself a tenner. So, so anyway. Not a big intro, but it's a long video but anyway I uh, hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you in the next one um, please hit subscribe if you enjoy it please hit the links below if you'd like to see any of my anything that I do with any of these if you want to see how they're mixed I will happily do that um, or how to because I've I have only got one really really dark one and that is when I do look really really dark um which hasn't been for years now but I still refuse to throw it away because for the, the one or two months I got out of it it's not worth buying one but now I've got the darkening drops I can actually use me so it might be worth throwing them away when I've tested these obviously so yeah so if you would like this a foundation review I'd absolutely just let me know comments below um, and I'll see you in the next one thank you bye